Hello there, I'm Sir Chopper Matt. We have many adventures here on the island of Shodor. I keep the best stories here in a large leather book. I have an exciting one about a big storm. Before we get started, please tell us about yourself. Type your name on my typewriter. Click the letters on the typewriter or enter them on your keyboard. Click the red tick key when you're finished. You can play the adventure in two ways. To play the story from beginning to end, click on the newspaper. To play the activities, click on the pictures. These are all the chapters of Thomas Saves the Day from beginning to end. One day at Brendam Dock, a terrible storm blew in from the sea. The troublesome trucks were growing restless in the yard, so Salty gathered them into the shed. He told them of the last big storm to blow through the island of Sodor, and that it was an heroic little engine that helped save the day. Thomas was on his way back to Knapford Station when the sky became dark and cloudy. The wind blew and the rain sloshed Thomas's firebox, so his driver decided to wait on a siding for the storm to subside. The next morning the storm had passed, but Thomas was still left without any dry coal. We need to find some more coal for your fire, Thomas, so we'll be able to drive full steam ahead, said his driver. Jeb Cole's work shed. Jeb. I don't think anyone's in there. Let's come back later. Wellsworth. A bucket of fresh coal. That will help heat up my steam. Now I have enough steam to get up the hill and then on to Knapford Station. Well done. Click the next chapter to continue the adventure. Ah, Thomas. Here you are at last, said Sir Topham Hatt. The big storm has caused delays all over the island and the cargo for Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory has been lost. Those crates are the very ones the workers need to make the chocolate. Please go to Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory at once and find out what help is needed. Knapford Switching Yard Brendam Sodor Windmill It's good to see you, Thomas. I was caught in the storm and the next thing I knew, I hit something on the track and came off the rails. I was just on my way to deliver a new hook for Harvey, but now I need him to come and help me. Could you bring him his new hook so that he can lift me up? Tidmouth Station we need to help Edward before... Bre Calhan Viaduct. I'm just helping Sir Topham Hatt to see all the things that need to be fixed after the storm. It's windy up here. Smelting. Hello, Thomas. I'm waiting for Edward to deliver my new hook. Have you seen him? Thanks for the hook, Thomas. Now, I just need a new chain to go along with it. Can you help me make the chain? We need to add links to Harvey's chain so that it will be long enough. Find a new half that matches the end of the chain. To add a new link, click on it to put the ends next to each other. To turn over the link you're trying to match, just click on it. When you think you have the right piece in place, click on the hammer to make a new link. We need to make four more links. That's one. Now you've got the hang of it.
That's two. Those match exactly. That's three. That's a match. Great job. That's four. Excellent. That chain is long enough for Harvey's new hook. My new chain is complete. Thank you. I'll go ahead and see if Edward's okay. I may need your help though, so I'll meet you back at the windmill. Ca nah. Sodor windmill. I'm still getting used to this new hook and chain. Can you help me guide the hook towards Edward so we can get him back on the tracks? Thank you, Thomas. Now I can get back to work and you can drive onto the chocolate factory. Good luck. Well done. Click the next chapter to continue the adventure. The workers at Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory were surprised to see Thomas. He was not the train they had been waiting for. But we've been waiting for Percy to arrive with our first shipment of supplies. He's terribly late, said one worker. They asked Thomas to help find Percy and his cargo. Sodor Windmill Tidmouth State There you are, Percy. The workers at the chocolate factory are looking for you. They need you to deliver their cargo. Oh, Thomas, it was so scary. In the storm, I crashed into something and all my cargo smashed into the cave and now I c c can't go in there. Why not, Percy? It's too dark and scary. I'm sure there isn't anything scary in there, Percy. I'll find you a new lamp and we can go and get everything. So... Nap. A new lamp. Just what Percy needs. Tidmouth Station. I think we should go into the cave now. Why don't you go first? I'll be right behind you. We need to tell Percy what all the spooky sounds really are so we can keep on going. Help me guess what each sound could be. What horrible creature could be making that sound? I see now, Thomas. It's only an alarm clock. Of course, that's what we really heard. I just know those spooky sounds are ghosts. I see now, Thomas. It's only a pair of scissors. Of course, that's what we really heard. <coughs> what horrible creature could be making that sound? <coughs> I see now, Thomas. It's only a slide whistle. Of course, that's what we really heard. Look, that's Percy's cargo for the chocolate factory. Thank you, Thomas. Now I should bring Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory their supplies as fast as I can. Well done. Click the next chapter to continue the adventure. The workers thanked Thomas and Percy. Now, Thomas, said one of the workers, we need three more items. 
Sir Topham Hatt has informed us that the wind blew the cargo all over the island. Do you think you can find the three missing crates, Thomas? This list will show you what items we still need to find. We need three more ingredients. Everything is going very well. We need three more ingredients. So... Tidma... Good job! You found milk. Milk. So... Napford Napford Gord Jeb Hello, Thomas. I could do with your help. Everybody needs the items in this shed to help them with the big clean-up. But there is so much debris from the storm, we can't get anything out. Can you find something to help clear away the branches? Well... <laughs> Jeb... Wellsworth, we still need two more. We still need two more. We need to find the three missing ingredients for Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory. Gord. Knapford Station. Knapford. Napford switch Brent Napford Calhan Viaduct Thomas, well, I'm glad you're here. The wind blew the cargo out of my net and into the river. Can you look for something to help me fish everything out? There's a lot of useful tools at Jeb Cole's workshed. You could try looking there. Smelting yard. Calhan Viaduct. Napford Swift So Mr. Jolly Good luck in finding the rest of Napford Swift A shovel. That's the haunted cave. We don't need to go in there now that the cargo has been found. Tidma. So. D Nap for Calhan Napford Stay We still need two more ingredients. The we still need two more ingredients.
Knapford Switch. <laughs> Brendan Cal. <laughs> Nap. <laughs> so. <laughs> Mr. Jot Tidmouth Station. Napford's <laughs> Nap <laughs> Go <laughs> Jeb <laughs> Thank you, Thomas, for clearing away all that debris. I have a handy bit of rope here, Thomas. Perhaps you should take it with you just in case. Gordon. <laughs> Jeb Cole's workshop. <laughs> Wells. Jeb Gordon's Knapford State Knapford Calhan Great! you found the rope. Now we just need something to tie to the end that can scoop up the crates for us. Cap Random Coast. This bucket... Calhan Viaduct Now that we have the rope on a bucket, can you help me get the cargo out of the water? Now that we have the rope and bucket, we need to help Harold fish out his cargo. Move the cursor to fly Harold around the screen. Click the mouse button to lower the bucket into the river and scoop up whatever is below. Watch the shadow on the river to see where the bucket will land. Thanks for your help with my cargo, Thomas. Would you like to take this crate directly to the chocolate factory? Good job. You found cocoa bee mil butter milk nap <laughs> nap <laughs> We only need one more We only need one more ingredient. Napford <laughs> Mr. Tid <laughs> So <laughs> Napford Switch Calhan Brendam Coast Brendam Coast So
Mist. We own butter. We only need one more ingredient. Good luck in finding the rest of the ingredients, Thomas. I'm glad we don't have to go back into the haunted cave. Nap. Brenda. We found all the cargo for Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory. We'd better hurry back so the workers can mix the chocolate for their shipment. To continue the ad Thomas had delivered all the supplies needed to finish the entire order of chocolate right on time. We are so pleased, Thomas, said the workers when the chocolate was ready. But now the shipment must be taken to Brendam Dock before Bulstrode has to leave. Can you please help us again? Thomas agreed to take the freight wagons loaded with chocolate to Brendam Dock right away. Sp Tidmouth nap. Cap Brenda. Brenda. It looks like the storm damage has been repaired, but now no one is in the signal box. Can you change the points so that we can head off down to the docks? We need to match the lever positions with the one shown in the picture. Clicking on the lever will move it to the next position. We're getting close. Just one more. Great! Now that the points are properly set, we can head off for Brendam Dock. Thomas, you are in our way. We won't do a thing you say. Thomas, you must hurry to the docks. Bullstrode is about to leave. Yes, I'm trying to, but the troublesome trucks are playing up. I'll help you, Thomas. I have a way of making them behave for me. Here, you lot, just sing along with me. We like to sing, we like to sing, but we won't sing just anything. Click on the trucks to help them sing along. Just click on each truck to match each note I sing. I'll keep adding notes until they're singing the whole song. Try this one. Your turn. Excellent. Your turn. Excellent. Your turn. Now this. Your turn. Excellent. Thanks, Salty. I don't know how you did it, but now we're on our way. Delivered the cargo to Bulstrode right on time. I'm very pleased. To continue the adventure, click on the next available chap. The chocolate factory's important shipment was delivered on time and everyone cheered Thomas for all his help in saving the day. To show their appreciation, the workers at Mr. Jolly's chocolate factory decided to make some special desserts in honour of Thomas, Sir Topham Hatt and all of his useful engines. Are you ready to make some chocolates? You can click on three parts of the machine to make your chocolates. When you're ready to start making the chocolates, just pull this lever here. You can change the controls whenever you want to change your chocolate. If you want to stop, just pull the lever. When all your chocolates are done, you can go to the gift wrapping room to wrap the box. Choose your chocolate. Good choice. Choose your shape. When you're ready to start making the chocolates, choose, choose, choose your, choose your, choose your, choose your shape. Choose, choose, choose your, choose, choose your colored, choose. If you want to stop, if you want, choose your chocolate, choose, choose your colored, choose your colored sugar. Choose, choose your, choose your chocolate. 
Choose your, choose your, choose your shape. Choose your, choose your shape. Choose your shape. Choose, choose your chocolate. Choose your, choose your cup. Choose your shape. Choose, choose, choose your chocolate. If you, your box is full, let's send it to the gift wrapping room. This is the gift wrapping room. Before you wrap your box of chocolates, you can switch them around or remove some and go back to make different ones. I am honoured to receive such a fine box of chocolates. Thank you and my thanks to Thomas and all my useful engines. Thank you for your help after the big storm. Are you sure you want to quit? Thank you for your help after the big storm. When you come back, we'll continue our adventure.